I refer to myself as a modern black person. I'm a, I'm a combination of so many things. The thing that made me like accept who I was. I was never really political, but I've always been somebody that stands for social justice. You know, I had to pinch myself because I, I couldn't believe that people that never tried it actually liked it. And I always get asked, like, why am I always posting African-Americans or like only black people? Do all these black people live here? And I'm like, yes, just look around. Stop expecting extraordinary things from every black person. Let them just be people. So even now, whatever I do with music or art, a lot of the time, I do it not for myself, but just so someone else can see like, okay, this is possible and I can do it too. Oh, this is so delicious. This is so yummy. Mommy, you have to buy it, please. This is so good. I was, that made me so happy that a little kid is like, you know, raving about my, my, my food. And so, you know, kids tell the truth. A documentation of like a living species and not people who have real stories to tell, real experiences and feelings, who laugh, who cry, you know, like, it's just, yeah, I kind of want to change that. You find that people here are more re uh, conserved, reserved, and, you know, it's not too loud, not too bright, and Africa is all about color. That, that was hard to say, I'm sad, I'm actually not happy um, this, this has happened. Music is always my number one. It's what I'm thinking about 24-7, all the time. Ask yourself, why do you feel unsafe around brown people? What has actually happened to you? Because, you know, ancestrally, I should be terrified of you for the violence that your people have inflicted on mine, but I'm not looking for revenge, I just want equality. Did I just rant? I feel like I just ranted like some, some reverence. <laughs> Is this video going to be shown to public? Yes. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs>